All right, what is going on, the people of YouTube? Welcome back. My name is Majestic. Today, bringing you guys another special reaction video to Mortal Kombat 11. So, you guys know I did a huge video a while back. If you guys have not seen it, basically talking about the leaks and how people are covering it, my thoughts about it, and stuff like that. Apparently, Mortal Kombat took a really big step and a good step, apparently, and announced like a full cinematic official story trailer, which has a lot of stuff in it and a lot of characters and stuff like that. So, as you guys have been telling me on Twitter, so super excited i like the story of mk9 i love the story of mkx i think that's what was like the big starting point for mortal kombat cinematics and stuff like that especially mk9 and how good the story was um and it explained a lot like how cabal was made cyber sub zero and stuff like that and raiden changed in the timeline so it was really cool and the mkx of course improvised on that made it even more dynamic more intriguing um gave you some story mini games and stuff like that I did, I introduced a bunch of new characters who I actually mained in MKX, Cassie Cage, who's fantastic. I love her playstyle, I love her corner setups. I think she's great. So I'm excited. I'm really excited. Hopefully, get to see some new characters, maybe some fatalities, uh, and just overall the story. Like, how is Chronica going to come into play? What the hell is her big scheme here? You know, uh, I'm, I'm excited. So, anyway, without further ado, I've done enough talking. Let's go ahead and get into the video. Roll it. All right, let me turn down my. This. Here we go. I am Kronika, Keeper of Time. I That's guide right. the destiny of the realms. But my work's perfection has been tainted by Raiden's actions. I oh, Aaron Black! Kano! Jump on! By merging past and present, who came? I don't know who that was. I offer a greater empire in the new era. Who's that? Your outworld armies defended. They shall. Chao Khan's fucking cannon. Oh, it's Jade. Okay. Solving this temporal crisis. Kotal! And in defeating Shao Kahn, I will have my scouts track Shao Kahn. Can't someone, anyone, explain to me what the hell is going on? Donnie and Donnie. Right? I've been in the future for a whole hour and I haven't seen one jetpack. Not one. Okay, from Aaron Black looks sick. That looks like Cassie. And gain control of her Kano. Only then will time's momentum be restored. We've got to take out another. That is Cassie. Now. Holy fuck, she looks great, dude. Can bring it here. It looks like her mama. Is that Eminem? As my is that Jackie? Matters, the new era draws ever closer. Cassie looks great, dude. Jackie, let's go! Oh! Cassie, let's go! Dude, she looks great, dog. Bro, holy fuck, man. That's 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 too much in my opinion. Listen. Nether Realm. You're doing too much. I understand. I respect it. I 1000% respect it. I'm not taking anything from you, but holy fuck, dude. So, Chronica looks like she's pulling all the big baddies to change the timeline that Raiden did so far. It's kind of what's going on just the generalization. We don't know. We're getting a little bit of it. But of course they're gonna run into alter shells, Johnny and Johnny. I'm saying probably Kotal and Kotal, Cassie and Cat. Like I feel like there's gonna be doubles of each one, Liu Kang and of course Revenant Liu Kang, Kung Lao and Revenant Kung Lao. So that's cool. At least we kind of understand what's going on and how the worlds are colliding, which is cool. So I, I want to see more of that. I'm more interested in her story and where she comes from. Apparently Chronica's been around since MK1, controlling everything and pulling the timelines. 
So I want to know more of her backstory as a character. But as far as things that we have seen, we saw Cassie Cage. By the way, redesign on fucking point, dog. I love that they made her look like her mom. I love it, dog. She is literally a Sonya fucking clone, and I'm cool with it. I thank you, Netherrealm. She looks great. Her redesign's great. Jackie, old school with the dreads, looks fantastic. Aaron Black. I think that's a younger Aaron Black. It's not an older one. In MKX, he looks a lot older. He's got longer hair and stuff like that. In this one, he looks younger. Like, maybe he just started doing bounty hunting. So, I'm thinking it's probably, like, a, a past Aaron Black. We probably will see a newer Aaron Black in the future. Maybe it's still him and maybe he's got a redesign. Because Johnny doesn't look as old. Well, he does kind of look old, but I don't know. He still looks great. He just looks younger and it kind of th it kind of threw me off guard. I'm thinking it's maybe a past Aaron Black. But... Aaron Black, Jackie, and Cassie confirmed all look great. Kano looks great. Kotal Khan looks great. Uh, I'm excited, man. That's a lot of announcements, dude. Cassie, Jackie, Kotal, Kano, fucking Aaron Black. I mean, holy shit. So they did really good. I'm excited for Mortal Kombat 11. I truly can't wait to play story mode. Anyway, what are your guys' thoughts? Are you guys excited for Mortal Kombat 11? You don't give a shit about Mortal Kombat 11? Please let me know in the comment section below. My name is Majestic, and I'll be back with some more Mortal Kombat 11 news, hopefully very soon. Peace.